When I was a little girl in the, in the beginning of the 70s, um, I lived by the coastline of the Gulf of Finland, in the, where Finland stop, stops and the Russian starts. And at that time, uh, I could find litter in the springtime on the shoreline. Uh, it looked strange. It wasn't anything that I could have bought from the shops in Finland. And I asked my mother that, how is it possible that the coastline is filled with, with litter? And I was told that that's because in some of the countries, you put trash, you collect it on the ice in the winter time when the sea fro is frozen, and then when the spring t comes and the ice melts away, it all floats away or sinks in the sea. Um, later on, I learned that which were the reasons were people doing that, and I understood it more better. Uh, and at that time, my mother and father forgot to tell me that I was a girl and I should not work on board a ship or be a sailor. And so I ended up being a mariner. Uh, I remember many beautiful things about my years working at the sea, but I also remember the view while standing on the bridge as a ship officer when the trash was thrown away from the ships. Because at that time, in the, in the 80s and the 90s, it was normal. There was no other place where to put the trash from the ship. Now it's changed. But change has been made by people who believe in the things that you can do change and you can make things better, but also people who understand what is really going on in the life. Um, then I became an authority and a research scientist in between. And I, what I found out is that you, well, if you know what the problem is and if you know what you want to make change, you can do it, even in quite big forums. But the key point is that you believe in things that you can do, whether it's the... A European Union Baltic Sea strategy or some smaller thing, you can change things by knowing and wanting them. <laughs>